fight, fighthype.com, yeah. here with the four division champion, my man Leo Santa Cruz. Leo, man, uh, first of all, what's what do you feel like is next? I know you wanted Ray Vargas, but he's got a mandatory, yeah, and, yeah. and you vacated the WBA title, yeah, right? So, so what do you want next, Leo? Uh, you know, I want to try 130, you know. Uh, that was, I vacated the belt at 126, because I thought I was going to be able to make weight, but I think my body grew and got bigger, and... I was gonna have trouble making 126, so I decided to vacate the belt. And I think I'm gonna try at 130. There's good champions right there. There's good fights, so whoever they offer, I'm ready for whoever at 130. Do you got your eyes on any of the four belts more than the others? Uh, I don't know that whoever, but you know, I, I was the WBC. Um, Ray Vargas, if he, I think he's gonna fight for it at 130. So if he fights, if he wins it, Probably go for him. Who would you say again? Sorry, it was uh, that? Ray Vargas. I think yes, yes. I think he's gonna fight at 130 again. Somebody, and if he wins, you know, probably fight him or you know, the Alto Valdez. Uh, there's a uh, Navarrete. So there's a lot of good fighters at 130. So any of them fight. You know, uh, Valdez and Navarrete, they are with top rank. Yeah, but how great would those fights be? That would be really great. You know, the both Mexicans. You know, so Mexicans always come to fight, and that's what we're gonna do. Go and give it a war. And yeah, but uh, who did you think was going to win that fight? If they were, I know Valdez yeah. got injured, but who did yeah, you think no. was going to win? It's going to be you know, a really good fight, but I think I'll probably give it a little bit to Valdez. Because you know? he has more experience, he's been in fight, so I think that, uh, Valdez. Do you feel like you need you know one more big win to get in the Hall of Fame, or you feel like you've already done enough? Uh, you know, I, I, like I said, you know, um, me, I just you know, go out there and fight for the fans, for the people, and you, the people are the one that they pick if you deserve to be there or not. Huh? But me, you know, I'm just, you know, doing my best and hopefully, you know, I'll be in the Hall of Fame, but I'm gonna do what I can to hopefully one day make it. Cause you look like you're still in your prime. Yeah, no, you got you, like you got everything in the tanks left still, right? Yeah, no, yeah, you know, we're working hard all the time. You know, we want to be one of the best, and that's what we trade with them. I gotta Open ask, it. um, you know, um, you're, you're hanging around 130, and the WBA champion yeah. Hector Garcia is yeah. gonna fight Tank. Yeah. Um, what chance do you give Garcia? Hey, Hector Garcia. I give him a good chance. You know, Garcia's a great fighter. He's you no, know, he's awkward. He surprises. He beat uh, Goldberg. He beat uh, the champion, the WBA <laughs> champion. Gutierrez. So yeah, Gutierrez. So you know, he could surprise, but. Uh, I think, you know, Tank is, is too strong. I think it's going to be too strong for him. Uh, but, you know, never, anything could happen. Anything could, any fighter could surprise you, and maybe this is the case. Will that fight be the case of Garcia will be doing well until yeah, the end? Until the, you know, yeah, because, yeah, you know, your band always does that. You know, he's, doing, he's not looking so good and everything, but then all of a sudden he comes with that big shot and knocks you out. What's the best advice you could give a guy going up against Tank? I don't say the in back with him, you know. That, me, I stood there, I got caught, I paid the price. But, you know, like I said, I try to appease the fans. You know, I do go out there and fight for them. I'm not going to go over there and run and move. I want to get an entertaining fight, even if I had to pay, you know, but the fans went, were happy. Well, he does have yeah. to, he's a, the, more the Dominican style yeah. than the Mexican. Maybe, maybe yeah. that it, it helps him more. Yeah, than, if, than the, he, he, has to, he has to box, you know, box him really good and move around. Not stay there too long because you know Tank is just waiting for that one shot, and he does have the power, so it's dangerous. What round do you think it happens? Uh, probably like maybe eight and under. Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. Uh -huh. um, you know Ryan Garcia, that's the one people want to see in April. Yeah. He said he's not going to fight Esta. Yeah. Um, did, is that is that smart or should he get that that fight I, in? in I think I think he should get a fight in because you know he needs the experience, he needs the rounds. He's been out for a long time. So to go in against a fighter like uh, Gervonta Davis, he has to get like a little bit more rounds in it and more experience. So, but you know, only he knows. What, what, what chance do you give your uh, your fellow Chicano from California, Ryan Garcia? What chance? Uh, you know, he he could have a pretty good chance because he's quick, he's strong. But you know, Gervonta is a smart fighter, and he it looks easy you know, when you're down here. It looks easy, but once you're up there, you know anything will happen. And I think you know, I think Gervonta's gonna be too strong. He's gonna catch him because. Ryan Garcia, he leaves himself wide open. When he throws his jab, he goes like that. And that's where Gervonta could come with the over right hand and knock him out. But you know, but he, he has a pretty good chance. Is, he's he still got pretty good chances. Yeah, he does, yeah, of course. Yeah. Is that a case where they're both fast and they both punch yeah. hard, but one guy's more skilled? Yeah, I think, and I yeah. think uh, Tank David could take a punch more. I think he's, he has the chin, you know, he sparks with big guys and everything, so he's used to it. And I think Ryan Garcia has a little bit more softer chin, so, but, you know, like I said, you never know. Should be a good fight. Yeah, it's going to be a great fight. But, yeah. uh, but thank you, Leo. You, no, know, you know, the fans, they love you, man, yeah, in and you. out the rings. So. I love the fans, too, and thank you all the fans. Yeah, yeah. Right, man. Hope we got, got to see you soon. Yeah, for, yeah hopefully, yeah. Thank, thank you, Leo. Oh, you're welcome.